Hey, fourth grade. Welcome to Thursday Art Day, best day of the week. Um, I look crazy right now because it's um, neon and sparkle day at school. So sparkles and neon, you know. Um, but all right, really quickly, um, I want to explain some things. I'm sorry about last week. Um, it's been a crazy, crazy two weeks, my friends. i um, trying to just balance being online and teaching in person and having early release and having um, school holiday. It's just been a little crazy. So um, the January 14th week, don't worry. There's not an assignment. You're not missing anything. Um, it would be as if we had like a day zero at school. So um, we're going to pick up this week. We've got some things to talk about. Um, we are starting Paint to Music. Now, some of you have seen that with Miss Paramore. Um, and Paint to Music has to deal with the music selection that y'all are talking about in music class. Um, we are talking about Beethoven. And we are talking about his song that deals with the thunderstorm. Now, Paint to Music is a contest um, that we, we apply for every year. Not apply, but we submit to every year. Um, it's a, we do fourth grade only because normally we go to the symphony and we do all these, this field trip and all this stuff. But with COVID, I'm not really sure what's going to happen this year. But um, I select pictures from fourth grade um, that deal with the song. Okay. So um, I'll get to that in a minute. But we have three winners, um, first, second, and third prize. Um, I do not choose those. Nobody at the school chooses that. Um, we send it off to the symphony and they have judges that will judge our school's artwork and pick our top three winners. Now, um, with that being said, I do send, I'm gonna send both virtual and on um, in person. So don't feel like just cause you're at home, you can't participate in this contest. So here's what's gonna happen, okay? I need you to, there's gonna be two folders in this week's um, stuff. That is going to be one with the music selection. Um, it should just be a link to YouTube for you to listen to. Uh, and then the folder that has like our submission stuff that has like the video and your instructions. You are going to listen to the music, okay? Um, it's only like a three minute song, so you can listen to it three or four times if you want to. And then you're gonna draw what you hear. Now, the hard part about this contest is that I'm not telling you what to draw. I'm not gonna um, tell you you have to draw a thunderstorm or you have to draw a violin or you have to draw an instrument. Um, you're gonna listen and hear what you kind of imagine in your head and put it onto paper. Now here are some examples. People have done instruments like violins or pianos um, and they've done like a piano across the page and then did all this pretty color in the background. Um, and some people have done, I know one of my winners um, two years ago had a um, really beautiful looking guitar. She made a guitar and then did music notes all around it in the background and then painted the background purple and pink, okay? And then painted the guitar brown and did all these really pretty colors. But um, this contest, you can use anything. Paint, colored pencils, oil pastels, crayons, markers, whatever you have at home. Um, and you're gonna listen closely to the music, all right? And see and listen to what you see in your brain. Uh, it can be anything, like I said, but no characters. We're not doing Fortnite. We're not doing Among Us. We're not doing anything like that. It needs to be um, not a character like that, okay? You can draw people. If you hear um, a ballerina dancing across the stage, okay, draw that. If you hear a boat in the middle of the ocean, in the middle of a storm, draw that, okay? If you just hear instruments, maybe you hear a piano and you want to draw a piano across the page and lots of designs and details, do that, okay? Lines, shapes, patterns, all those things are important to add into this picture. Um, I don't really have an example because I can't tell you what to draw. That's the craziness of this, um, of this contest, all right? Now... Um, this week when you're working on this and we're going to work on it next week as well You need to make sure that you are when you are taking a picture. You're taking a really good picture. Okay, I don't want Forks and knives or crayons and things in the picture I just want a picture of your artwork because if I send this to get judged I don't want them to see stuff all around. I want it to just be your artwork. Okay so with this being a contest, I want you to be proud of your artwork. Okay, take pride in it. Do your best. Not that you haven't done your best, but try your hardest. And you know, you can do it on um, regular like computer paper or construction paper. Do not do it on notebook paper. 
okay? It needs to be just on regular paper. Um, so in your folder this week, you're going to have your, um, there's gonna be a page with the music selection on it. You just click on it, it's gonna take you to YouTube to this song. Listen to it, you can even listen to it while you're working. Because when it happens, um, when it happens, I cannot speak. Um, when it is playing in my classroom, we're silent, we're working, and I play the song over and over and over and over for the whole class. Okay, whole class period, 45 minutes. Um, and while you're drawing, while you're creating. Okay, um, you're going to submit what you have. Um, you can start adding color if you want to this week. We're going to finish it next week. So it is a two-week project. Um, so don't feel like you have to rush. And if you get stuck and you're like, oh, Miss A, I don't know if this looks good. Can you tell me? I can help you with that. I can tell you, oh, maybe you need to make your guitar bigger. Or, oh, you need to possibly fix your piano. Whatever you're making. Okay? Use Google. Look up pictures of instruments. Look up pictures of music notes if you need to. Put those things in your drawing. Okay? So paint to music doesn't necessarily mean paint. It can be crayons, markers, colored pencils, watercolor, paint, um, anything that you have. Um, but with paint to music, it's really cool because it's your own creation. I'm not telling you what to draw. It's what you hear. All right. So again, I'm sorry about last week. Um, it's been a little crazy, but this week um, I'm going to upload everything you need and we'll go from there. So I will see you soon, Lions. Enjoy paint to music. Um, it's pretty fun. The song's really cool because it really does sound like a thunderstorm. Um, and if you hear a thunderstorm, you can draw that too. It's up to you. Um, but enjoy. I will talk to you soon and I will be seeing you on Schoology. Bye, friends.